This is the true nuanced answer of if you need to go gluten and dairy free for PCOS. And this is coming from a licensed nutrition professional with eight years of experience working with PCOS and I have PCOS myself. So let's start off by saying that gluten and dairy are not necessarily bad foods and there is no direct connection between gluten and dairy and PCOS. So why do you hear about people who go gluten and dairy free and it completely resolves their symptoms? There's two reasons for this. The first and probably most common reason might be that somebody who is coming from eating a standard American diet that has a lot of processed foods and fast food who switches to gluten and dairy free by extension has to remove a lot of those foods. And so they end up feeling better and their blood sugar is more balanced, which helps reduce symptoms. The second reason is that those with PCOS are more likely to have issues with imbalances in their gut bacteria, with digestive health issues, and are more at risk for also having an autoimmune condition. Each one of these things raises the risk of somebody having food sensitivities or food allergies. And because gluten and dairy are some of the most common foods in the American diet and some of the most common food allergens, when someone with PCOS who has food allergies or sensitivities removes gluten and dairy, it will reduce a lot of inflammation in the body, which will then cascade by reducing testosterone and improving symptoms. So do you need to go gluten and dairy free for your PCOS? The answer is not yes or no. The answer is maybe.